Hey guys, so uh, on Wednesday Google announced Android 4.3, which is uh, minor improvements but some good ones and it should uh, make the phone a lot faster. But uh, you can only get it for Nexus devices, which I have, which is a Galaxy Nexus. And it's on 4.2.2, which is uh, almost the latest, but as I said before, 4.3 is the latest. So we're going to go ahead and update this. So uh, it says I need to connect the charger. I forgot to switch on the plug. That should be it now. It's charging. So now I just have to uh, restart and, and install, which could take a second. So uh, it's just going to switch off right now. And the data connection switched off. And now we're back to Google, which isn't focusing right. So it is blurry, but uh, it says on the screen installing system update. I'll try and refocus, but I can't. some reason so basically with 4.3 you can uh, have more than one user and you can set parental controls which is really for the most part what the whole thing is also has touch improvements so if you have a Nexus 4 you'll probably know about the slow touch screen well this will fix it and basically this should be the last version until Kilan Pi unless of course there's uh, bugs in this which I hope there isn't and uh, if this device does get Kilan Pi I'll be doing a video exactly like this it also has OpenGL 3.0, which should uh, speed up game performance. And uh, it has uh, Bluetooth low energy, which that's pretty important for Google Glass. Still updating. But uh, you guys, I'm gonna switch the light on so uh, you'll be able to see the actual color. So I'll just set it right here and I'll be back in a second. Alright, there it is. Let's see if we can focus back in. Yeah, and that's it. So this is just the uh, Android modification uh, screen, which I like to call it. Because if you erase your device, uh, this will show up. Except it will just say erasing. So uh, Galaxy Nexus... Uh, yeah, <laughs> Nexus devices get it um, straight after the release, and uh, if you have a Google Play Edition phone, well, it'll come soon, apparently. And if you have an Xperia device, you'll get it too. Samsung also says it'll come to select phones. 
But uh, if you don't get it for this, you'll probably get it for Key Lime Pie. So we're almost done. But then again, this will take a while because it usually does in the last bit. Oh, no spoke too soon. Right, we got the Google logo up again. Now Nexus. Hopefully this is the last boot. We should be back up. We also get Google Keep built into it. But because it's a minor opening, it's optimizing your apps. So uh, just as we're waiting, uh, comment in the description about what you'd like to see in Android 5.0. Again, this is a good signature because, uh, well, <laughs> well, really a good message because this is just optimizations and nothing, no new features. So uh, that means Keyline Pi is going to be a lot better. So we just have another 12 more apps to update, so it shouldn't take too long. Now the installation of this is uh, 139 megabytes and we're just finishing up and there we are so uh, if we go into our settings see it's exactly the same Sorry guys. Right. And uh Android free point. Yep. So that's it. Thanks for watching and uh hopefully I'll be making a video about the new features in this. Thanks for watching.